Hello, I haven't posted in a while, nor have I practiced the way I'm about to. So I thought I'd kill two birds with one stone and share it. I have an objective. It's a painful one. It's one I don't feel like doing. I just don't. But I have to. Because the more resources I collect by way of mechanics on the instrument, the more I can use some of those in a musical way. Because I can't play musically if I can't play. See what I'm saying? If I can't do the thing, I can't use it. So I'm going to try to do the thing, which is to develop strength in my lower body with a pattern that has 10 notes in it. And here it is. Now, this is designed for me. It's not for anybody else. I know what I need physically, and I know how this is helping me. It's like a, writing a prescription for myself, in other words. So here we go. That can be perceived in many different ways. The easiest way to perceive that is by thinking five and doubling it. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. By using an alternating pattern, it's causing a disturbance in my ability to play that faster and more accurately. It's, it's an uncomfortable thing, the way that I'm doing it, the way that I'm perceiving it. So. Um, what I need to do is keep my hands busy or think something that makes me not speed that up and record the wrong technique. Well, that's the simple, that's a simple part of what I'm doing. I'm just going to play it and then I can make more videos explaining parts of it. But essentially, I have a mission. That pattern helps me with my mission. I'm going to hit it very strongly and accurately and I need to repeat that in order for me to repeat that I have to do something that's uncomfortable and difficult otherwise I'm going to speed it up and spoil the whole purpose which is I'll be recording a poor technique for the sake of speed which comes later with this kind of a thing there we go and to keep my hands busy watch how I build this <laughs> accenting whatever hand, whatever drum I'm hitting with the right hand when it lands on the right foot on one. Now I'm going to change that. Just the accent. things going on with three of my senses. There's something I'm layering in terms of my thoughts with feeling. I know what I'm feeling and when I'm feeling it. And I'm thinking about what I'm feeling. I'm thinking about what I'm hearing and how all the different sounds being hit are, are prioritized in my mind as well as what I'm looking at. That's I, In other words, I know where I am in the pattern. I'm trying to be accurate with just striking the drum. All these things are layered and prioritized just like if I am working with um, one of my children, let's say it's baseball and football skills, I notice an extreme, an extreme acceleration in skill when, uh, let's say, my son speaks the commands that I speak on the drums. Like I think, turn and flex, turn and flex, turn and flex. Well, uh, I see him bend, step, bend and step to step and throw, he's getting more velocity pitching and it's working very quickly, almost instantly, as opposed to just, okay, let's go out and practice pitching here, throw the ball. Mm, no. It's like, now wait a minute, what's the objective? Here's how we're going to do this. And of course, it's not well received all the time because nobody likes to work. I don't even want to work. I don't want to sit there and do this. It hurts my brain, you know. It spoils the fun, right? Anyway, uh, I'll post some more videos about uh, that, that follow up what's happening here. But essentially, I have a mission. It's to develop some strength in my legs. Um, I haven't practiced any stamina things in a while. So I have to keep busy. I'm going to use my hands and my voice and my mind to layer things to keep me repeating. And that's what it is. This can be done.
come with a four-piece kit, by the way, as I'm hitting five, it's, 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 it's ten down here, but it's actually a pattern of nine up top. That can be done with a four-piece kit. Let me quickly show you, and then I'm out. One plus two plus two equals five. So it's one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, one. A pattern of nine with the hands while the feet are doing ten.